Hello guys, my name is JB Dan. Today I will show you how to how to install a new get package on Visual Studio to 2022 or 2022. Here, for those who don't know what a new get package is, new get package is an extension to like to expand the ability of your current program. See, NuGet package is a simple, uh, is a sing, single zip with the new KG extension that contains compiled code, aka DLLs, other files related to that code, and a descriptive manifest that includes information like packages, version number, version number, and yeah. Basically, it expands the ability of your program. Now open up Visual Studio 2022. As you can see here, I have the preview right here. Now Microsoft redesigned the whole Visual Studio thing. Also, in the next video, I will demonstrate you my newest program, Pastro. I still need to code it so yeah it's on pro it's on progress now for this for this tutorial we are going to use csharp.net framework because that is the most from that is the most familiar thing i can ever encounter when using visual visual studio net as you can see here Search C -sharp .net and you will get Windows for app.net framework using C -sharp. Name it whatever you want. And then create. There we go. Now, as you can see here, resize it whatever you want, give it a title. But here we are only going to focus on adding a new Git extension. So, go to the project here, manage new Git package, and click to browse. Now, as you can see, search whatever new Git package you want. Now, for example, Gong shell. I know this one, and yeah, never mind. Just material skin. And there we go. Click install the install button. If it was for Microsoft, then you need to accept license and agreement despite being free. Well, it's a freeware, not an open source. So, yeah, now this is a new skin, a new look for your form. Now you, your form itself will relatively look like this. Now as you can see here. Now to change this form's look, <laughs> we are going to use material design, the NuGet package. This is just a demonstration on how to utilize the your installed NuGet package. save all and one and when you run the form again now it look like this this is a perfect example of how to utilize your installed NuGet package now it really depends though you after you install it the first thing you can do is to import it to your project by you know you by this I'm pretty sure that every programming language have a way to import libraries and extension but that's just about it guys if you find this tutorial helpful please give it a like leave me a subscribe and leave a comment thanks for watching and i will see you in the next video goodbye